Howdy folks, Daniel Rubino here at Windows Phone Central. I just want to show you a quick little feature here in Windows Phone 8. That's the ability to check for an update to the OS. And you can just hit this little button. You can see my options there as well. And it goes and check for an update. Now technically, if you recall, we actually had this in Windows Phone 7. But you couldn't do anything with it if there were an update, which... You know, there was very few of those actually happened. But you would have to go home, plug it into your computer, and download what was basically a new version of the operating system. So it was a big update. Windows Phone 8 is different that way. You can download actually bits of updates. So presumably you're going to get smaller over-the-air ones. Well, let's just see if that's accurate. Well, look at this. This is the HTC 8X on AT&T. And if we go into Phone Update, if I can actually tap that screen... An update is ready to download. Yes, I got a, a little pop-up that looked just like that. And it tells you you can do it over Wi-Fi or cellular. If you dismiss it, you'll see you'll just be back on that screen. Otherwise, we're going to hit download. It gives you another warning. It actually tells you the size of the update, which is pretty cool. And then we're going to download this live. Let's hope it works. Now, I've already seen someone tell me this failed. So, we'll see what happens with this update. Looks like it downloaded, now it's installing. <laughs> and this was the same error that uh, I saw tweeted to me on the internet, so it looks like it failed. So that's not uh, very good, but perhaps they're just testing it. This is technically a pre-release device, but at least you can see how the system works. It's kind of interesting. So we'll follow up more on this to see what's going on with these updates. But there's your first example of how an OTA update will work on Windows Phone. Take care, everybody.